case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. United States v. Robinson, a 1976 case heard by the United States Court of Appeals for the Second Circuit, focused on the right to a fair trial and the ability to present relevant evidence in defense. The case stemmed from a bank robbery in which three armed men stole from the Trap Falls office of the Connecticut National Bank. Two suspects were identified, but Appellant Robinson was accused of being the third man. His conviction was later reversed due to errors in evidentiary rulings that affected his alibi defense. The court found that the FBI's photographic identification procedures were suggestive and that the exclusion of Maher's testimony, which could have proved that the third man was someone else, was an error. Additionally, the government's attempt to discredit Robinson's alibi witness was found to be insufficient. The court reversed and remanded the case due to these errors, stating that the trial court's rulings affected the defendant's rights by excluding testimony and admitting inadmissible hearsay evidence, thus prejudicing Robinson's alibi defense. As a result, a new trial was ordered. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.